Adrian said the Dodger transactions had just been temporary. That he was already back on track, and when the Capricorn Bank contract came in, I was convinced. So he bought you? No. I didn't take that promotion as a bribe, I swear. And then later, when the dodgy deals didn't stop, I, I kind of protested, but, but not a lot. Every time it was like, just once more, Sfiso, just to pull us through the slump. And after a while, it became normal. I, I, I didn't see it as a crime anymore. Just loopholes. And, and then it all just started coming undone fast. It was spinning into a black hole. Adrian, Adrian, he got desperate, made mistakes. It was a fucking nightmare. And that's when he asked you to help him escape? Yes. I helped him. And in turn, I, I got to turn state witness. I don't want to go to jail for something I didn't do. It's funny you should say that. I swear, Sam, I, I, I didn't know you'd do time. I couldn't believe it when you got arrested. But then I heard about the account you opened. No one else had anything to gain. So you're not the whistleblower? No. I didn't know anything about that account. Then who the fuck was it? Because there was DNA evidence that was tampered with. Who was involved, Sophie? So tell me. I, 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 don't, I don't know anything about it, OK? I swear. OK, I, I, I was just a small car. Yeah, with a very big salary. Why did Adrian come back to the house after the funeral? He'd taken the, the wrong passport. It was like some kind of a joke, except it wasn't funny at all. He was supposed to take the fake one and, and leave the old one behind. He, he couldn't go back to switch them because the house was full of people. That's so why I had to hide him in our back room till he could get to his safe. What was the name of the new passport? No idea. Where did it go? Botswana. I was going to fly to Maputo from Khaboroni. I'm sorry. I don't believe Adrian would do this to you and the kids. And yet he did. <laughs>